Hello my friends, my family, and my followers, it's Hike360 here. I'm here to give you a new hike this week. I'm at Fort Morgan, which is on Mobile Point, the tip of Mobile, across from Dauphin Island. So we're at Fort Morgan, and the first battle to happen here was in 1812, and it was in commission until 1920? 40, 19, World War. 1940. 1940. Was retired in the Second World War. So it's got a long history. I read that it was constantly being improved upon and built up, refortified over and over again. Uh, there was. Oh, yeah. Wow. This is big. So this is a star shaped fort. Originally it was just a fan shaped fort in the 1812, 1813 era. And it was um, in the Civil War, and they turned it into the Star, and uh, was uh, actually so. The facts that I thought was really huh. were interesting. In the Battle of 1812, the fort surrendered. There were two big battles with the British, and the in the first battle, the the ships, the British ships were repelled. The second battle, the fort surrendered. Yeah. And then it was turned back over because it, the war had actually ended like two months earlier, but the word the war was over hadn't spread yet. <laughs> um, and then during the Civil War, this became a, uh, it was U.S. military before the Civil War. Alabama militia took it over during the war for two or three years and allowed for um, supplies to break the blockade for the South. Because apparently, the, the war, we just don't need, need to worry about people trying to invade the shores. This isn't going to stop. <laughs> Where are you going? goes through. Holy cow. Really thick walls. So this is all what supply? Sleeping quarters? Sleeping. stuff was moved back and forth, right? Munitions. Almost a 360 degree view from the floor. And you can see everything. Uh, the sign down here said this big gun, which was the biggest of the guns uh, during the early 1900s, could fire a thousand pound shell eight and a half miles. Eight and a half miles. And it was 1900 pounds, it was almost 2000 pounds. Oh my gosh. Uh, and you can see everything. There's no way a boat can get through here. Now the question is aiming. Like how do you hit a small boat when it's three miles out or four miles out? But you can see, let's see. Okay, so Dolphin Island is straight over here. This is where we came with the ferry. You can see the uh, bridge. So this is going to be mainland Alabama up there. 
which means down this way is the heart of the Gulf of Mexico. And apparently uh, German U-boats came up this far. That was news to me. I didn't know that they had that much range. The other factoid that stuck out was the recruitment of slaves from local slave owners to rebuild this That was board. in the 18, early 1800s, yeah. Wow. Pretty amazing stuff. I mean, this is, this is where you'd build a fort. Yeah, it is. It'd be interesting to see what Fort Pickens looks like. Ooh. You gotta get over to that spot. Hey, make a comment if you are a history buff, military history buff. We're obviously now a bunch of military. Uh, if we're missing stuff, please make comments. Woo! And it's cold.